Yes, morning to all. So today's session we are going to cover that is the embedded system. Already we have seen the topic uh, introduction of embedded system, build process of embedded system, structural unit and uh, last class selection of processes. Now we are going to see the uh, selection of uh, memory device and uh, that is the uh, DMA operations. DMA operation. These two topics uh, we are going to be see, right? Okay. That is that is the memory. That is the PC memory. This is the PC. Uh, that is personal computer. Uh, that is a personal computer based memory. Yes. Mm, what is this? Is the pen? Um, personal. This is the personal computer. Personal computer based memory. But uh, our system, which is uh, uh, doing us uh, embedded, embedded systems. Okay, em embedded systems. Already, I am also uh, doing that. That is a uh, yes, small board. Okay. It is a small board of that uh, uh, system. We are going to be used for that in the embedded systems. So this embedded uh, system, we are uh, uh, utilizing that the uh, memory. For what pur purpose we are utilizing uh, that the memory uh, in the different criteria uh, we are going to be seen. So what are the criteria? Uh, uh, we are going to see so the, the this is that that is embedded system uh, we need that the memory so what type of that is the memory is required that is a program code we want to store our the code that is by room read only memory next we are going to execute the program in the processor so we need the ram uh, random access uh, uh, memory random access memory so next that is we need that uh, uh, data storage that is uh, data storage data storage uh, data storage so this is we need uh, uh, that what type of memory we are recording uh, uh, requiring uh, that is external storage external external uh, storage so for that purpose we need that to the uh, uh, system okay the every example if, if you need some example i am using that the camera that is uh, this is that the camera assume me a camera uh, video camera that is video camera video camera so that is the capturing uh, what is the image that is image or capturing image or uh, capturing capturing of the signal is a program is a program or that is op code op code okay but uh, that is it may be going to the uh, size of a large memory size i am also already told to you that is image processing this is is nothing but the image processing so we need the large memory for temporarily storage for what storage temporarily storage temporarily storage so for that purpose we need uh, that the thing is called uh, ram so for that purpose we need that uh, we need the uh, ram okay so purpose so after the processing the signal i am also going to store the image that is store store the image store the image store the image so in the external device in the external device external device okay so the writing of that in the digital board is a huge difficult for the pen so for that purpose that is the letters uh, may be in different shapes so that is uh, the external device so what are the external device we are going to be used that is the different disk is hdd that is hard disk drive 
Uh, another one is uh, the uh, pen drive that is HDD hard disk. Next one is uh, CD drive based. Uh, nowadays that is the SSD will become solid state drives, pen drives. Next one is DVD, right? So now we are going to categorize the uh, memory in different CADA. How we are going to categorize? First thing we are going to consider for that uh, the memory which is used in that primary this is primary memory uh, right this primary memory uh, which can be mostly used in mostly which can be used um, in which place mostly we can use in that uh, mostly 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 used mostly used in inside the chip please keep it your mind inside inside the chip so primary memory uh, that is that is the ram and rom most probably it can be used in the uh, uh, that is the inside the chip uh, specifically this is 100% most probably or uh, uh, more than 90% that is greater than 90% which can be used in that uh, that is uh, in process memory this is, is greater than uh, that is 75% we can used in the in process that is which in the inside the chip so what purpose already I am also explained if the camera which can be measured program and uh, compute the segmentation this is the program this is the program the program is stored in the ROM the processing of that data the data which may be the processing so processing we need the RAM we need the RAM this is my large size so after processing we are going to store the results in secondary memory we are going to store the uh, uh, memory in the secondary memory so that memory is HDD hard disk drive FDD nowadays it is vanished almost vanished uh, that is a floppy disk drive that is most probably the dominating device is pen drive next CD uh, compared uh, next DVD so these are all that device we have used it uh, the device but uh, the, this is the same cadder nowadays another one thing which is available in the SSD yes sd external hard disk that is this is also the as like a pen drive this is external this is a external 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 device solid state uh, memory drive solid state drive based uh, memory so this is the uh, basic uh, thing of that the memory so what is my code so different things we have going to be considered first thing that is uh, type of memory type so type of memory whether it is uh, that is primary or in secondary if the primary that is what type of memory ram or rom again that the sec secondary as like this this type of memory hdd uh, ssd at, up to whatever that so next one thing is that is the main another one concept is speed speed that is speed RAM speed what is the speed of that memory it is very important operation that is the speed of operations uh, if the processor speed is very high but your RAM speed that is our ROM speed is very low the entire process speed will also going to be low if the processor speed if your processor speed is high your ram speed is low your entire process uh, process speed will also going to reduce if the processor speed is also uh, low but ram speed is very high uh, your uh, process your process speed is also a medium but at the same time if you are going to put the processor speed is high and uh, ram speed is high 
your uh, process your process speed is also a yeah, high right that is the keep it to your mind so that is the important thing uh, you may going to consider you may going to consider for selection of memory so that is the the speed of uh, operations next one is what is the power consumption in last class i am also ex uh, explain how much of the power is consumed by the ram during the storing and the processing because ram consumes the much power uh, during the execution during the execution so how much of the power we need so next one is uh, what is that the cost cost of that memory so next one is that is the the cost which also depends upon the speed which also depends upon the uh, uh, that is uh, type which also depends upon the power next one is uh, uh, that is the uh, uh, size physical size physical size okay size and also this type and the size uh, this size is this size is which may go into bit size that is bit size that is 8 or uh, uh, that is uh, 16 32 and 64 128 that is a different bit size so these are all the the basic uh, memory selection but uh, this is also not only sufficient we will see how it can be further improvement of the uh, memory selections okay now that is the memory selection that is the memory selections first that is the cpu right keep it your mind cpu that is the temporary storage for this is that the catch so what is that the catch operation see if you are ro run the program 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 definitely the program having a code the, the program having a code right what code that is op code op code which, which means program code that is the speed of this processor you are assume uh, that is the 3.5 gigahertz processor right but uh, your memory is uh, already you may going to say that is 600 megahertz speed of the ram uh, the memory or less that suppose in the cpu processor can also go into very fast processing very fast processing so after if you are going to put the insection by insection insection by insection it may almost very fast for that purpose the cpu on itself the cpu on itself some uh, registers some register catch the some registers space space or some memory space memory space can be used that is called the catch memory so that the uh, up code which can be suppose the up code is a uh, thousand up codes thousand up codes i am also taken as a hundred uh, sorry that is the hundred of blocks hundred of uh, blocks that is 100 100 100 of blocks so 100 100 that is 10 into 100 that is which is equal to uh, 1000 right so that is 100 by 100 my catch memory having a capable of holding the 100 in uh, uh, 100 that is uh, up codes total up code is also a uh, 1000 i am also first i am going to uh, this uh, uh, 100 up code into the catch memory the processor which may going to start to execute again uh, for uh, uh, that is it may going to start to execute it it may going to reach us that uh, less than 25 percentage uh, of that the catch again i am also going to load the the remaining uh, up codes so this is nothing but uh, as like here uh, that is bottleneck operations the catch is very very important so the catch is one of the as like a RAM temporarily temporarily storage area. RAM will also this is the physical this is the physical uh, and the virtual memory. So both the things 
suppose nowadays uh, that is a ssd disk having a, a also going to handle as like a ram suppose if you are using number of uh, uh, process uh, during the current process only current currnt current process only hold the uh, physical ram the the holding process the holding process uh, operation which may be going to in virtual memory this is taken by the hdd or that is sss nowadays that is the device so this is the another one type next one is permanent storage memories this is rom already i am also told to you to store the op code that is the program that is the program next uh, removable de device as like uh, pen drives so network uh, or internet uh, based device this is cloud cloud based device next one is hard disk already you are well known the hdd or fdd or cd or dvd or ssi ssd so these are all the devices which can be used so similarly the memory selection is also the uh, is the function of the uh, our uh, board uh, our board embedded that is embedded board board architecture architecture and uh, that is uh, type that is uh, type of uh, uh, applications type of applications suppose that the embedded board which can be used uh, that is that uh, uh, motor control that is uh, motor control uh, we are not used the image processing so the we don't need that the highly process maximum 3 cycles 3 cycles uh, uh, signal will be hold 3 cycles means which is uh, uh, that is the 60 milliseconds assume that is our frequency that is 50 60 milliseconds so that is each and uh, uh, one that is a 20 millicycles each cycle one heads that is one heads i am also going to sampling frequency of uh, one kilohertz one kilohertz so the one kilobyte data uh, which may be required for 20 milliseconds so that is 60 the three kilobyte three, three kilobyte of data is sufficient for sufficient for what uh, that is the uh, ram uh, so 3k almost in the market uh, uh, that is uh, 4gb ram as like this the 4k ram is sufficient uh, for execution of your control mechanism as like this what is the uh, purpose what is the applications so that uh, application or that purpose which can be placed here uh, uh, significant role significant uh, role for the memory so that is the thing here we are going to be mentioned for level one and level two some processor uh, some processor uh, see this is the task manager this is the process thread this is OS based handled so memory i am also going to memory so memory what is 6.2 bit this is ram ram that is the used the remaining 1.5 gb of which is 1.9 gb which is available uh, and committed cache memory please see that is 30.8 gb that is cached which is that is uh, the 1.4 gb that is cached so in my processor having a sufficient memory i am also going to do the so much parallel processing because so paged pool is 545 uh, MB, non-paged pools is 80 MB. What is mean by the memory pool? I am also explained during the uh, subsequent units. Okay, so that is uh, C, our uh, processor speed, C please see. That is the, our, pro now the processor that is the turbo boost is 1.1 to 3.5 gigahertz. Now the processor which can be working at uh, that is 2.5 to 2.65 or 2.7 gigahertz speed. But my memory maximum speed is what is that uh, the uh, 2667 uh, which means uh, only 2.66 uh, uh, that is the gigahertz uh, the speed which is uh, not 
is matched with the actual systems so we need the sufficient uh, speed we need the so, sufficient speed so this is disk zero disk zero is not utilized which means my disk is uh, uh, that is uh, this is the hard disk my disk is a ssd based is, uh, disk so that is a ssd based disk what is the zero or one percent because i have the sufficient memory of the ram i have the sufficient memory of ram which is available catch also reduced available uh, that is uh, 1.3 gb is uh, 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 sufficient there is no need to uh, 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 that is the access the disk space so that is enough so this is a uh, wi-fi because the online classes is going on the what is the uh, net in my net speed upload and uh, uh, download around that is uh, 500 uh, kbps is uh, sufficient this is for the graphic operations graphic operation that the shared cpu that is 3.9 uh, uh, gb which is available but only 1.2 which can be used so remaining i am also run parallelly run the video so much thing because it is uh, uh, that is separate cpu for my uh, intel graphics and neveda this is the another one graphics cpu i am put uh, the in my uh, system but i am not utilized till now based on the current requirement so this is the memory we have going to be split uh, depends upon our uh, 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 our requirement based on, upon our requirement only uh, we are going to be utilize the memory utilize the memory so that is the point suppose i am also going to be uh, uh, change over the any other applications again the memory captured memory of the system will be varied you may going to see that is that uh, as chip process that is the cpu memory memory disk networks so how much of that memory which can be uh, uh, utilized so this is the performance of that the uh, system i am also explained during the atas uh, explanation of that atas i am explained detail uh, whatever our uh, requ uh, requirement okay similarly that is if you are using that the keyboard um, uh, so that is the keyboard so the keyboard which can be read some uh, uh, memory that is not high thing but the mouse it is very very important because i am moving the mouse as like this very 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 fast so that is we need the what type of data x y data so now i am moving my pen my pen my pen also moving x y axis okay next removable media so that is the pen drive that is pen drive or i am also going to connect it in my digital table uh, uh, digital board okay so i am also going to use the digital board this digital board we have used to have a sufficient memory right so that is the thing next scanner camera mic and audio now i am also use the audio it is very important it may use as my audio will also going to use the uh, mic systems will also going to use the details of that the memory how much of the memory which can be uses in the agm service audio everything in my video so everything it can be see the memory the m lock that is memory allocation system allocation audio and audio uh, video memory allocation which is available here right so these things you may see in newer system also right so next the the remote source uh, uh, suppose in the uh, iot lab session i am also going to connect my uh, mobile camera to the pc mobile camera to the pc so it is easy to connect uh, our mobile camera to the pc so that is the remote uh, both are it will be connected by wi-fi wi-fi so other thing we have going to be connected other resource suppose if used in embedded process drives and controls we have used some memory so the memory allocation or memory selection we have been going to consider these points what are the points we have considered please uh, uh, see so that is type of memory it is a primary or the secondary type of memory next is speed of operations 
the speed of operations which is the how much compared with the your processor used next one is how much power is required by the ram cost of uh, uh, the memory how much cost it can be very depends upon the speed and the power consumption and other types so next one is that is the uh, that is the uh, processing uh, that is the processing speed how it can be the physical size physical that is how much gb so already i may explain uh, how much that is the uh, uh, thing we are going to uh, require uh, so the size of uh, the bit is required so already i am uh, explained that is nearly 4 gb Na nearly 4 gb memory is sufficient here i am explaining that is the how we need that is the 4k that is 4k ram as like this this 4k ram which is uh, uh, enable which is uh, enough to uh, what is this enough to uh, that is the physical size next one is size the this size is nothing but the bit size 8 16 32 uh, 64 and 128 so we are going to select the memory in different category which means uh, uh, first uh, what is the application what is uh, next one is uh, type of memory speed power cost physical size word size everything we have keep it in your mind based on that our application we are going to select the suitable memory okay now i am going to uh, stop that is